Hello everybody, it's Tom and Jerry Fan 64 here and and it, and as promised in the last video, I'm be doing a movie review of the X2 X Men Night. And I did review the first two three X-Men movies on my channel already, along with I did do a rant on X-Men Origins Wolverine, but I deleted it. Because I now enjoy X-Men Origins Wolverine. Please don't hate hate me for that. So yeah. And I almost forgot the X-Men The Last Stand I used to have on DVD, but I threw it away from the reason I should have just kept it. So yeah. X2 X-Men United is definitely my personal favorite of the X-Men movie series. And I think X-Men, in my opinion... I think X-Men is my favorite franchise. One of my all-time favorite franchises from Marvel. It's tied with Spider-Man. It's tied with Spider-Man. But if I had to choose him, please don't hate me. I hope, I know I'm... I, I hate to disappoint Spider-Man fans, but... Even though I, I think... I think X Men might be my favorite franchise. I think I like my my I do like Spider Man more than X Men, but it's hard to choose. I like them both. But if I had to choose, I hate to disappoint Spider Man fans, but I would have to choose X Men. But the Spider Man movies are really awesome. So yeah, I really enjoyed the X Men movie. The X Two X Men United I used to have on VHS, but I threw it away because it was moldy. I hope to get the VHS of X Two X Men United back in collection. There's a better condition, and I hope to get X Men. The X Men X Two X Men United on DVD. This movie is really really awesome. I really enjoyed the movie X Two X Men United, and Ian McKellen is probably the best Magneto, and Michael Fassbender is also a great Magneto. But I think if I had to choose who is my favorite Magneto, I would choose Ian McKellen. And by the way, guys, um. I want. I forgot to mention that when I do my review of X Men First Class, X Men First Class is going to be a spoiler review, and my movie reviews. To Deadpool, to Deadpool, the first Deadpool, and I'm gonna do it. My review for the first Deadpool that I'm re reviewing is gonna be a spoiler review. Same thing with Deadpool and Wolverine. So Deadpool and Wolverine will probably be a spoiler review. So if you guys don't want those movies spoiled, I highly suggest you go that. But uh, the X2, X Men United, and X Men Three are not gonna be spoiler reviews. But X Men Origins Wolverine, I don't know if it's gonna be a spoiler review. And X Men Origins Wolverine, I used to have on DVD that I got from my sister Delilah, but I threw it away because the disc was scratched. I hope the DVD X Men Origins Wolverine back in in better condition. See, X2 X Men United is a great movie. See, I'm gonna give the movie X2 X Men United a 10 out of 10 stars in A. And I almost forgot to mention that Famicom Jansen is great as Jean Grey. I really wish we could have saw Jean Grey, Famicom Jansen, reprise the role in Deadpool and Wolverine, but I don't know. But what's really cool about Deadpool and Wolverine is that there's a lot of cameos in Deadpool and Wolverine. And what the good news is Deadpool and Wolverine is playing at the Bijou Theater in Lincoln City, Oregon. But I don't know. I'm not. I'm probably not going to see it in the theaters, but I'm probably see it on Fetch Fruit or on Disney Plus. I'm probably going to watch it on Fetch Fruit. So yeah, like I said, I'm going to give X2 X Men United a 10 out of 10 stars in the Plus. It's a really great movie. And if you guys want to, please comment down what is your favorite X-Men movie. My personal favorite is X-Men, X2 X-Men United. So that is it for my movie, the X2 X-Men United. Which I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you're generous enough, please consider leaving a like on this video. Subscribe because it really helps out. And I'll see you guys all in my next movie review, which will be on X-Men 3 The Last Stand. So I'll see you guys then. Adios.